We're just moments away here from this hot competitive season matchup alongside Ray Ferraro. My name is James Sabalski bringing you all the play-by-play. Setters glide into position for the opening draw. The Whalers start with possession as we are now underway. Great read to break up the play. Quick feed to Lemieux. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it along the wall. And it's freed up over to his teammate with a nice kick pass. Here's a short pass to McDavid. And that's picked off in front. And now he angles it across to Ferraro. The Whalers have it from their own end. The Red Wings have it against the wall. Moves it quickly over to Lemieux. Grabbed along the boards by Verona. The Red Wings ready to go on the attack. Blocked in traffic. Sends one up to Verona. Gretzky's got it deep in the offensive end. Pittsburgh's gained possession along the boards. Oh, smart heads up, Reed. Puck scooped up by McDavid. It's a two-on-one. Here's the pass. That's intercepted. Play whistle dead because of an offside. Kopitar has won it. And now it's grabbed by Duchesne. Here's a chance. And that's taken by the defense. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. Kunitz works the puck in his own zone. The Red Wings get a hold of the puck in the open ice. And a delayed penalty coming up as he got tripped up. And let's see what the definitive call is on the ice. Caught him just as he was picking up speed, and he's going to pay for it with the trip. Oh, you're spinning with him. You're trying to get your stick into the puck lane, and you end up tripping him up. The Red Wings get their man advantage unit out there for the first time tonight. And if you're one of these power play guys, James, you can't wait now. It's your first opportunity of the night. You get out on the power play, you want to make a difference. Trying to dump it out, and they do just that. I thought they did a pretty good job there, James. That's a time you can get yourself running around in the zone. They didn't get there. Catered of a shot, and the shot dies in the traffic jam. Big save. This has been a heck of a shift for them. They've got them hemmed into the offensive zone. Now they can carry the puck around as the defenders are just going to play a tight box. They look exhausted. Ahead of... Scores! The power play delivers big time! Puck moved quickly. The players move quickly. That's a terrific goal taking advantage of the extra man. draw first blood here as they score the opening goal of the contest here. Coaches and players always talk about getting out to an early lead, how you can dictate the pace. Smart heads up play to intercept the pass. Tries to feed it over to Iserman. With some momentum driving towards the net. It's in the back of the net. He scores! Two goals in 50 seconds. So quickly on the board. Wow, insane how quick that was. Bang, bang. Yeah, the defending team just couldn't put a stake in the ground. They couldn't stop them. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. The Red Wings have recently taken a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Tries to get it to cross. And now it's over to Besser. Wow, completely ignored the whistle there. Past the midway mark in this period. We've got a 2-0 game here tonight. And a solid job tying up his opponent. Centered out in front! And that one's broken up! Here's a blast! Whoa. And it's in! He scores! Uh, the release beats the goalie here. But there's a good break, too, as the puck hits the post and goes in. Seems like everybody stopped for a little bit there, James. When it hit the pipe, they weren't sure. But it's in the net. So quickly off the post and in. The Red Wings are dominating in almost every facet of the game here in the first. 
Nobles has won the draw here in the neutral zone. The Red Wings look to start the transition game. Puck picked up by Simpson and tries to make a diagonal pass to Iserman. Picked up along the boards by Kunitz. Handles the puck. There's the whistle as the puck goes out of play. The Red Wings have been all over them, and there's still plenty of time left in this first. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Along the half wall with the puck, and he loses control of the puck. Moves the puck along the half wall. We got a penalty coming up here as the officials blow the play dead. Hamilton's getting called for tripping. Like every player in the history of the game, he doesn't like the call, but he's going to have to go serve his minor penalty. Pittsburgh's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. Well, here's our first power play of the game. You'd love to score on your first one if you get the chance, because that helps the power play become more confident. More confident always means more successful. Quick feed to McDavid. The Red Wings have possession shorthanded. With possession along the wall. Puck grabbed by Doughty. Lays into the body. The Red Wings get a hold of the puck along the boards. Heads deep inside the offensive zone. Gets in front of it. Taken by Kopitar. And another stop. That's why a goalie can never relax. He makes one stop. Now he's got to be sharp to make another. Trying to clear from the defensive zone. There's the whistle icing the call. The Red Wings have capitalized on their scoring opportunities and lead comfortably here late in the first. Off the try, and a nice job locking up his opponent. Got to give the penalty killers a lot of credit as the penalty expires. Well, no go on that power play. They were able to move the puck around, and I guess at times it looked dangerous, but just nothing really going on the power play. They let that one slip through their fingers. The Red Wings gain control of the puck against the wall. The Whalers take possession of the neutral zone. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. The Red Wings have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Pittsburgh's got possession here in the neutral zone. Here they are on the attack. Slides it across. He scores! Patrick! offensive zone here as the shooter keeps moving around till he finds the open spot in this case it's goal he's in the high slot and he hammers it home there's the whistle offside is the call the red wings have controlled this game here in the first period more shots more goals ferraro's won the draw here in the neutral zone the Whalers gain possession in their own end. The Red Wings get a hold of the puck. Redirected! Great pad save. Now, by being in the right position, James, he gets so tight to the shooter, there's nowhere for the puck to go. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. The Red Wings have been the better team so far in this first period. They've had multiple scoring opportunities, and as a result, have the lead. Now he takes it over the line, picks up the puck in his own end. The 360 with the puck. Move to the middle. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Well, that'll do it for period number one and a chance for both teams to kind of get a refresh here. They'll head to the rooms, and here's hoping there's more offense in score because that was a most entertaining opening frame. We got a 3-1 game. are back at center ice and we are ready to get period number two underway here we go middle frame now underway as the puck drops 
Ray, what's your assessment of the game to this point? Pittsburgh's got to find another gear or two or three here. They've been behind almost all night. They haven't had the puck very much. As a result, they're behind on the board as well. Denied by the goaltender. Quick pass to Verona. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. Tosses it to McDavid. They've got the defense outnumbered. Big shot from the back end. What a save. He'll probably feel that one tomorrow. Slides the puck to Tavares. And that was stopped. Picked up along the wall by Riley. Here he is, shot right in front. Big stop by the keeper. Stop one, stop two. The goalie makes a couple of excellent saves. Over the line they come. Way right out in front. And that's picked off. And he comes up with it. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Taken along the wall by Doughty. Puck scooped up by Besser. Moves it to Tavares. A little crashing and banging forces the turnover. Shoots it denied by the goaltender. Another stop by the goaltender. Nice work in there after the first stop. He's got to find the puck to save the second. To his teammate. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the wall. On oh, a great defensive play there. Takes it across the blue line. And a great save. LaFleur's lugging the puck. They've got numbers. On the attack along the boards. Scooped up along the wall by Noshek. Rocked him along the wall. Slides the puck over. Moves it to Ovechkin. And now it's grabbed by Ovechkin. The Red Wings have it from their own end. Moves the puck up to Nosek. Takes the feed from the left side. Puts it on goal. Gets a piece of it with the blocker. Puck picked up by Cross. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. The Whalers gain possession along the wall. Here's an odd man rush. Sends it across. The Red Wings get a hold of the puck in their own end. Passes over to Simpson. Moves right to the middle. And he totally whiffs on that one. Comes up with the stop. Slides the puck near the front of the net. The Red Wings scoop it up along the boards. Wrist shot from the slot. Oh, and it goes off the stick. I think through traffic like that, you're just hoping the thing hits you. And now he moves it to Barkov. Intercepts it in the neutral zone. Too much congestion blocks the shot. Looks to pass it to Ovechkin. Carries it in. The Red Wings have it behind the net. Angles it over to Besser. And look at this, a three-on-one. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. Intercepts the pass. Drives it to the front Whoa. of the net. And he scores. Once he gets in nose to nose with the goaltender, you're always trying to sell the shot. If you're going to deke it, he goes to the forehand and puts it away. The Red Wings have to be feeling good about themselves here in the late stage of this second period as they continue to lead big. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Scores! Two goals in 50 seconds. So quickly on the board. I think we can officially call this one a route now. Yeah, this is a steamroll. This is over. The Red Wings are on cruise control here in the second. They have absolutely dominated. Pittsburgh's got the puck in their own end. The Whalers take over on possession. Second period nearly into its final minute here. Too many bodies in the way. Keeps hold of the puck. And there's the save. Quick feed to Fraser. Intercepts the pass at center. Takes the feed at center for the right wing. Here's a short pass to Ferraro. Hard sounds bringing the second period to an end. If you'd like to rub shoulders with some of our players, don't forget to go to our website and check out our next charity event.
And we are just moments away from the start of the third period. 20 minutes to go here in regulation of what has been a very one-sided affair. Ray, with two periods in the books, what are your thoughts on the game to this point? Pittsburgh's been a step slow almost all game. They haven't had the puck very much. They're losing. If that's going to change, they've got to get the puck and hold on to it much more. Moves it quickly over to Fraser. Now we'll get a stoppage on the ice here. Now the puck sails down to the far end of the ice. So go back to the defensive zone and try it again. The Red Wings are on cruise control here in this third period, leading big. McDavid's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Now a quick pass to Kane. Offside is the call. Oh, he ripped that right after the whistle. What's he thinking? The Red Wings have built themselves a sizable lead here early in this third period. This neutral zone faceoff set to go, and we are back underway. Lifts the stick and takes the puck. Manages to hang on. With the blast. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Grabbed along the board by Lemieux. Nosek's taking it from his own end. Puck grabbed by McDavid. The Red Wings look to start the transition game. Break away. Oh, and he missed the net. Oh, you got to get it on the net. You got to test the goalie. Quick pass to Kunitz. Big chest save as he gobbled that one up with the trapper. And now he tries to get it across to Gretzky. Taken by Lemieux. That's three consecutive goals. Now the goalie keeps looking over to the coach saying, why am I still in here? Three straight for them. No way sometimes for the goalie to catch up to the pass. It's too quick. It's one-timed into the net. The Red Wings are in cruise control here, but they're showing no signs of letting up. No, the lesson began about two hours ago, and it's not class out yet. Puts it on net. Stopped by the goaltender. Ahead of steam now towards the front. There's another stop. Look at that right oh. there. While he lowered the shoulder down, he read that play so cleanly he was able to close up the ice. Nowhere for him to go. Just a cinder block he ran into. And he regains control of the puck. Here they come. Three of them. Sends it over. Makes the save. Picks it off. Look out. That's a great heads up play to break up the pass. And gets control of the puck once again here in the open ice. The Red Wings get a hold of the puck along the boards. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Picks off the pass. Floats it right onto the tape. Works it across to Granlin. Great read. Comes up with it. And makes the save. Picked up along the boards by Tavares. Drills him with the stop. And instead of a whistle, clears it away. Scoops up the puck now. Moves it to Kucherov. Out front. Duchesne's moving the puck through his own zone. And the pass is picked off. The Red Wings gain control of the puck against the wall. And now he angles it across to Shen. Reads the pass perfectly and picks it off. Here's the pass. Stopped by the goaltender. Takes the feet under pressure. And he slides it quickly to Simpson. Passes right to the front with the stop. Puck scooped up by Barry. Denies him again. He's right on it. Two consecutive saves. Top ones at that. He scores! Aye, aye, captain! The Red Wings have really been strutting their offensive prowess. You've been impressed tonight? I really have. They can put it on cruise control now. A large lead here in the third period. Pokes the puck away. And now it's grabbed by Barkov. Oh, he'll feel that one. Simpson's got it across the line. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Stopping the play. The Red Wings are in the home stretch of this one, leading big time in the third. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Puts it up front, and that's broken up. Hamilton's got it in the defensive end. Tried to get 2Q with it and loses possession. Here's a chance. 
Oh, comes up with a stop. He says, let's get physical on that play. He scores! There's their second of the night. Well, I guess they can look at this and say, hey, we did a couple of good things way too late, but it's something for them to try and build on. He's not going to feel very good about that one when he goes and sits down at the bench. He was totally out of position. That led to the goal. Puck is dropped and play resumes. The Red Wings have it against the wall. Slides the puck across to Shen. This one-sided affair finally nearing the end. Linesman blows the whistle, signaling an offside, and this one's not done yet. The Red Wings have pummeled their opponents tonight. They have been the busier team offensively and have converted numerous times here in this third period. Puck picked up by Noshek. Pittsburgh's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Move to the middle, and that one's broken up. Takes it across the blue line. A little bump and grind, but still hangs on to the puck. Verona stick handling in his own zone. Regains possession at center. Passes right to the front. And that's broken up with a stick in front. And makes the save. Save made by the goalie. Hey, that means the play's supposed to end here. They're still pushing around pretty good. The Red Wings are going to want to bring this big lead home late in the third. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. And now it's over to Gretzky. Intercepts it at center. Picked up along the wall by Riley. The Whalers gain possession along the wall. The Red Wings grab possession to the puck. There's the whistle, and a penalty is coming up on this one. Kane's going to the box for tripping. Once he puts up his little token argument here, he's going to circle around a bit and try and regroup here as he goes to the penalty box. Were you box. a haggler? Always. You never think it's the right call. Off the draw, and he ties up his opponent. Swing and a miss. And that will close the book on this one here tonight. Really dominant performance. I guess you could notice that from the way that they had the puck most of the time. But they won this very comfortably tonight. Even the fancy stats crew would agree with this one.
small, you're a giant. We got stand up on our tiptoes, shout to the world, it's our life. I couldn't touch it from the get go. We're gonna be so right, gonna be so. We got stand up on our tiptoes, shout to the world, it's our life. I couldn't touch it from the Welcome back, everyone. Alongside Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabolski. Well, they were relegated the last time they were on the ice, so it can't get any worse from here as we get set for this Hockey Ultimate Team Challenge. And we are about set to drop the puck on this one. Well, the hype for this one has been off the hook. Puck is dropped. Let's see if this one actually lives up to it. Shot, glove, save, quick reflexes. won the draw here in the offensive zone looking to make something happen along the boards blocker saved by the goalkeeper and the puck is in but it's being waved off immediately here yeah i like when all goals count but i i think this has to be waved off this is goalie interference o'reilly's not going to be very happy with this they've waved this off this looks pretty clearly like goalie interference play set to resume and you can see they're still frustrated by that non-goal call O'Reilly's won the draw here in the open ice. The silver tips slide it through center. Stopped by the goaltender. <laughs> Offense is on face off and he wins the draw. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it along the wall. Quick feed to Verona. Here they are on the attack. Slides it across. Stones him in front. Aggressive stop out on top of the crease to make the save on a dangerous chance. Right out front. And that's picked off. With the steal. The Whalers gain possession in their own end. Great stick work with the steal. Takes a shot, and it's off the iron. Puts it on net, puts it just wide of the net. He didn't have much room. He's making the attempt for a perfect shot there. And he makes the save. And that's broken up. The Whalers, he scores. You make so many decisions that happen so quickly. Every once in a while, you get one wrong. That's an example of a bad decision. 
Nobles wins it. Puck grab by Noshek. Time of the goal. Six minutes. Into the corner. And that one's broken up. Raquel's got it along the boards. A chance in front. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Carries it across the line. And they'll be forced to regroup as the puck escapes the offensive end. Passes up ahead from the left wing. On the doorstep. Finds nothing but air on that shot. And he feeds it down to Cahoon. Here he is, wrists it on net, turns it away. Handles the pass from his goalie. Here's a blast! Gives up the body to block the shot. More than half the period has expired. 1-0 is where we sit at this point. Barkos won the face-off deep inside the offensive zone. And that one's turned away. The Whalers scoop it up along the boards. Great read by the keeper to poke it away. The Whalers gain control of it. Let's it go. Comes up with the stop. Takes the pass from his goaltender. The Silver Tips take possession in the defensive end. Pittsburgh's got possession here in the neutral zone. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Score! Oh, the game back to level now. Anybody that's had a lead, the lead is gone, and now we're evened up again. Larkins won possession. Taken by Kleppbaum. Kleppbaum swinging the puck through center rice. Kleppbaum's got it along the wing. The silver tips gain control of the puck against the wall. Gets in front of it. And now he passes up to Kane. Right in front, and that's picked off in front. Here they come on the attack. Centering pass, dropper save. Goalie plays it up, intercepted. Likens carries the puck in his own zone. With some momentum driving towards the net. Here's an offensive chance. Puck knocked loose after that hit. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. Oh boy, here comes a three on one. Gets a stick on it. The Whalers get a hold of the puck along the boards. Puck scooped up by Nurse. Let's it go. Denied by the goaltender. Taken along the wall by Noshek. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Nosek. The Whalers have it against the wall. Pittsburgh's got the puck in their own end. He just got rattled by that big hit. Slowly, he's kind of meandering to the bench. They got to get the door open for him and help him get into the bench to get looked at. Moves it around along the half wall. There's the horn. An entertaining 20 minutes of play as we are tied at one. start of period number two. Still tied up here as we get underway here in period number two. Comes up with the steal. Great balance as he scoops it back up. Stopped by the goaltender. He decides wow. to cover it up and sends it away. And now he moves it to Piranha. And now it's grabbed by Domi. Kane swooping in on the attack. Stays with it. Here's a short pass to McDavid. Wait up front! A chance to clear! Cross the blue line and they'll get that much needed change, Ray. Yeah, they've got to get guys off the ice. They look tired, now you can get a fresh group on the ice. And that one's stopped. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Moves it quickly over to Domi. Brilliant save, read it perfectly! The Whalers gain possession along the wall. Gobbles that puck up with his chest. Nosek's got the puck in his own zone. Kane's carrying it ahead. Moves the puck. Quick pass to McDavid. And he comes up with it. 
Great defensive stick work on the play. They've got the defense outnumbered. He got all of that hit. Takes a whack, but still hangs on. Takes a bump and loses control of the puck. They've got numbers. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. The Whalers pick up the puck here in the neutral zone. Over the line they come. And that one's broken up. Likens has it in the defensive end. Ovechkin's going to play it against the half wall. Moves it to Lafleur, Denied by the goaltender. Nearing the midway mark of the period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. And that's intercepted. He scores! They take the lead. Well, it looked like this game was going to be even for the longest time because nobody seemed to have the upper hand. Face off here in the neutral zone and we are back underway. Gartner's got it into offensive territory. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the wall. It's a two-on-one. And that's picked off. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Rocks him on the play. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Just slide. And that pass is stolen. Let's it go. Wide of the net. I like the shot. He didn't miss it by much, though. Gardner's dangerous in the offensive zone. He's got it now, and he's already got the go-ahead goal. And he gets the puck right back. Into the corner now. Here he is with the backhander. Pittsburgh's gained possession along the boards. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Knocked away. Turned aside with the glove by Miller. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. The Whalers are looking to build on this one goal lead. The frozen biscuits dropped and we are back underway here. Icing is called, stopping the play dead. Pittsburgh's look good offensively to this point, but they continue to trail here in the second. Granlin's won the faceoff. Scooped up along the wall by Granlin. Quick feed to Larkin. Great read to break up the play. Trying to make something happen while trailing, and this one doesn't complete. Moves the puck over to Cahoon. Offside the call, and we'll have a faceoff just outside the blue line. Just here in the late stages of this frame, it's a 2-1 game. Good read by the winger as the two setters tie up. Cahoon's got it in the offensive end. Comes up with the stop. Pittsburgh's had plenty of good looks offensively, but they have been snake bit as they trail late in this second period. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And there's the save. Nice pass. Here's a short pass to Ovechkin. Here he is in front. Beats the goalie, but can't beat the post. Moves it quickly over to Nosek. Hammers the shot. Scores. That's two unanswered now. Uh, they stayed right on it. Once they got that first one, they just pushed the pace of this. Now they get another. Well, he can really shoot the puck there, and that just blows by the goaltender. He didn't really have a chance. The Silver Tips have had no shortage of good looks so far tonight, but they still trail here as we approach the second intermission. Steps in all of that. That goes wide. Probably better off to take a little off the shot and get it on target. He's nowhere near the net. Pittsburgh's got it in the neutral zone. Puts it on net. Stopped by the goaltender. Near the point. The Whalers gain possession in their own end. They've got numbers. To his teammate. Makes the save. From the place 99 made famous. Horn sounds to end the second period. 3-1 is where things stand as both teams take a breather heading into the third.
Be sure to attend our auto and light truck show next weekend. Welcome back, everyone. Both teams lined up at center ice, and we are ready to get this third period underway. Moment of truth for one team. Here we go. Third period is underway. The Whalers get a hold of the puck in their own end. Great defensive play to break it up. Grabs the puck and looks to make something happen. Subras plays it into the offensive zone. Into the corner of the attacking area. Hangs onto the puck. From one point man to another. Too much congestion in front. Let's it fly. Makes the save. What a reaction with the blocker. And he elects to play the puck. Receives the pass. And he's taken down the official's arm, signaling for a penalty. Here comes the call. Looks like tripping the call. Sometimes they're lazy. Sometimes they're just bad luck. The Whalers will have a chance to get on the power play for the first time this evening. Off the draw and a nice job locking up his opponent. You gotta have a shot. Oh, there's gonna be a penalty on this play here, James. Penalty coming up here as the play is stopped. Sin Ben Bound for tripping. I always hated taking tripping penalties. It always felt like there was something I could have done better than that. Penalty. Carries it in. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it along the wall. Quick pass to Nosek. Pittsburgh's got control of it now from their own end. Bank pass off the boards. Pittsburgh's ready to go on the attack. And makes the save. He reacts late, but he makes the save through traffic. Through center along the wing. Oh, and head hunting there. I think he did. Man, that thing is way over top of the net. And as he skates back out onto the ice, it's a brief power play. They'll have to go to work here. The silver tips get nothing here on this power play. We're back to even strength. And he's tripped up on the play. Referee's hand goes up here. Here comes the sentence. Just an old school tripping call here on this yeah, one, right? Sometimes I think you just get burned here. A little bit of a bad break. You're fishing around for the puck and your stick gets into the other guy's feet. Way too much congestion blocks that. Grabbed along the boards by Cahoon. Pittsburgh's got the puck shorthanded. Gets that puck back on a stick. Big time stop there. Up along the wing. Sends a pass over. Levels them with the hit. The Whalers have it in the offensive end. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. The Silvertips get a hold of the puck under man. Makes the stop with the blocker. Granlin's exploring options with the puck. Reads it perfectly, breaking up the play. I like he wants to move it quickly, but make a safer play than that. Heads deep inside the offensive zone. Penalty expires. You really have to admire the effort of the penalty killing unit on that one as both teams are back to even strength. A good work by those penalty killers in this case. They're able to keep themselves in touch with the game, give themselves an opportunity to climb back in. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the boards. Picks it off. Look out. Moves it to Kane. Puts the puck on net. Off the mark. Goaltender's in good shape. There's not much room at all there, and he ends up shooting it wide. Sends it across. What a great read, breaking up the pass. Here's an odd man rush. Great chance in front, and that's broken up. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Tries to dangle, and the puck skips away. Vakanen's in good shape here, but he ends up losing the puck and overhandle. And the linesman calls... on the play and the coach calls for a huddle with a timeout here what sort of message do you send here well the first thing is is try to get everybody organized and rested and then whatever play you've designed you want to make sure everyone knows where they're supposed to be well past the midway mark of this period crowd's been into this one right from the get-go it's 3-1 the whalers scoop it up along the boards 
Oh, just on his textbook hit. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Pittsburgh's looking to break out of their own end. Gobbles the puck up there with a the chest. Nice feed from the goaltender. Takes the feed. Tosses it on to McDavid. Sends it over with the stop. The Whalers gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. Just slide to the net. The Whalers get a hold of the puck along the boards. Getting a little physical out there, but still holds on to the puck. Coughs it up on the play. Quick feed to McDavid. McDavid's got the puck. Pass right in front. Gives them nothing in front. The Whalers gain possession along the wall. Picked up along the boards by Lafleur. Along the half wall with the puck. Centering pass. Just misses. Big time stop. Gets the puck back onto a stick. Nice defensive robbery on that. Through the neutral zone. Moving the puck along the side. Here's a chance. Here's the pass. Picks off the pass in the defensive zone. LaFleur's got it across the line. Feeds it down low. With the stop. Elects to play the puck. Takes the feed from his netminder. Here they are on the attack. Slides it across. And it scores! What a shot! Critical draw here. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. By number 21. Icing is the call, and how big is this looming face-off now? Really critical face-off in a, in a game that is at this point. This face-off becomes one that is a must-win. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. The Whalers have it against the wall. Smart read by the defender to come up with it. Quick pass across to Kucherov. Rocked on the play. Another big hit. Man, this guy has one color on his mind, and it's the other team's jersey. Skate, hit, skate, hit. It's been that all night. And we are all over with this one. Now you can wrap up a pretty tight victory here. Well played by both teams. Not really much to choose between them. That was them. intense, am I right? Really good game. Really not much at all to pick one over the other. If they play ten times, we're going to split these games. I'd be okay calling every single one of them, too. Maybe they wouldn't ask you to. Thanks. Welcome back, everyone. Alongside Ray Ferraro, it's James Sabalski with you, ready to bring you all the action for this hot competitive season matchup. Opening face-off is set to go. Referee Shil Lebeck is ready to drop the puck. The Whalers start with possession as we are now underway. Takes it across the blue line. And makes the save. 
flies it over to Crosby. Here's a short pass to Marchand. And that one's broken up. Slides it quickly to McDavid. Takes the pass. Stopped by the goaltender. He'll keep it alive and moves it ahead. The Whalers gain control of the puck against the wall. McDavid's lugging the puck. And now he tries to get it across to Verona. Slides the pass over to Hedman. And now he angles it across to Crosby. Slides the puck near the front of the net. Puck picked up by McDavid. Play is blown dead. We've got a penalty on the way. And he's heading to the box for two for tripping on this one. This is such a bad penalty to take because you put yourself yeah. in a bad spot. A player falls down. Now you're cooked. You go to the box. Well, he's got two minutes to think about it now. Four minutes, four seconds. The Whalers scoop it up along the boards. Right in front of the net. Puck grabbed by Gartner. Shot, and he makes the save. Minnesota's won the face-off deep in their own end. And now it's over to Eichel. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Likens moves the puck. Play whistled dead because of an offside. Granlin's won the draw. Now he slides it up to Ovechkin. Back at the point, they set it up. With the blast! Makes the save with the glove! We got a penalty coming up here on the play. Whistle blow stopping the play. Ovechkin's getting two for boarding here. I don't have too much problem with that penalty, James. To me, that's a pretty clear boarding penalty. Nobles wins the draw on their own end. Trying to get it out of danger. And that one's turned away. Picked up along the wall by Giordano. Right in the low slot. Taken by Lafleur, And as the penalty expires, they'll go to work now on the man advantage. Moves it quickly over to Goudreau. And that goes off a player. The Whalers get a hold of the puck along the boards. The Wild have the puck in their own end. Quick pass to Dreisaitl. Takes the feed. Here's a chance in front. Comes up with the stop as he got a piece of the blocker on it. Kunitz brings it in. Excellent stick work on the play. Feeds the puck over to Dreisaitl. Still anyone's game as the power play comes up empty-handed. Sometimes you go on the ice with the best of intentions and it goes all wrong right away. That's how I'd characterize that power play. Oh, and he tracks it perfectly in the offensive end. To his teammate. Here he is on the backhand. Denies him in front. Big save by the goaltender once again. Quick work. He makes one and two saves in a row. Move to the middle. Minnesota's got the puck along the wall. Here's a shot. Great glove save. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Moves it to Darlene. Here's a chance on the doorstep. Here's a chance on the backhand. Oh, what a save in front. Quick feed to Barry. And he moves it up to Verona. Back on a stick now. Sends the pass over. They've got the defense outnumbered. Grabs control of it at the point. Sets up from Gretzky's office. Takes the feed from the goaltender. Carries it across the line. Let's one go. Comes up with the stop. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Verona. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Trying to get back on the attack now. Centering pass in front, and that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Barkov's got it in the offensive zone. The Whalers ready to go on the attack. And that one's blocked. 
Slides it diagonally to Malkin. Here they come on the attack. Here's a short pass to Darlene. The Whalers look to start the transition game. Verana's got it against the boards. Moves it quickly over to Verana. Puck scooped up by Crosby. The Whalers gain possession along the wall. Referee's hand shoots high in the air. Looks like we got a tripping penalty coming up. And let's see what the call is. And he's off to the box for two for tripping. Not much of an argument there. A stick between the player's feet. And they'll roll the power play unit right back out. Easiest thing in the world, James. Tell somebody else to relax. The power play hasn't scored yet. They're not relaxed. And it's not easy to do. But that's the key to success. Barkov's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. And now he moves it to Barkov. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. Gets in front of it. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Retrieves the puck, trying to kickstart this power play. Handles the puck. Slides the puck over. Nice poke check. Straight up the middle. Here they come. Take it along the wall by Gartner. Unloads it. No room for that one to get through. And that's all she wrote for period number one as we are still scoreless after the first 20. Clean sheet of ice, period two is set to go. Minnesota's penalty killers have their work cut out for them here, but a nice start to the period as they win the draw. The Whalers get a hold of the puck in their own end. Over the line they come. And now it's grabbed by McDavid. And that one's broken up. The Whalers come up empty-handed on the power play. Both sides back to even strength. Jostles the puck loose. Puck picked up by Kane. Denied by the goaltender. Too much traffic in the lane. Here's an opportunity in front of the net. And that one's stopped. Quick pass to Kane. Dishes it to Verona. Moves the puck behind the net. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Slides it across to Marchand. Takes the puck at the point. Back in or in strong. Oh, and a good opportunity right there. You don't get many chances. You want to finish them off, so he'll be a little frustrated as he heads back up ice. Minnesota's got the puck. Takes it and looks ahead. There's a shot, and he comes up with it. Scooped up along the wall by Malkin. Puck grabbed by Lafleur. Flexes another save. Oh, he's on it there. Both saves are really good ones. Puts it to the front of the net. Amazing stops. Oh, he followed the puck really well there. A couple of good stops. Granlin's won the draw. Taken by Petrangelo. The Whalers grab possession to the puck. Puck scooped up. Score! Quick blast, no chance. Ah, the goalie just can't keep up to this, James. The pass is in the wheelhouse, and he hammers it past the goalie into the net. Malkin's won it, and now it's grabbed by Barry. Grabs it in his own end. Moves the puck. Moves it to Ovechkin. From the top of the offensive zone here. Grabbed along the boards by Barkov. The Whalers have it against the wall. Huge steal in his own end. Through center along the wing. On the attack along the boards. Scoops up the puck now. Picked up along the boards by Ovechkin. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. 
Here's a blast! Denies him on the play! Dreisaitl's got the puck along the wing. They've got numbers! Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. That's broken up in the neutral zone. From the slot, wrist shot, puts it high! Yeah, it sounds great. He scores! Vladimir Tarasenko! James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Puck picked up by Burns. And that one's picked off. With possession along the wall. Keeps hold of the puck. The Whalers gain control of the puck against the wall. Picked up along the wall by Tarasenko. Passes on over to Goudreau. Moving to the middle. Fires it. Oh, what a save in front. Miller's able to get out and make the save on that great A chance. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. And he came up big on that last opportunity. In the final moments of this period, it's all tied up. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. The Whalers go to work on offense. Quick feed to Crosby. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Sends it across. Oh, they telegraph the pass, and he picks it off. The Wild have gained control of the puck in their own zone. Drives it to the front of the net. Denied by the goaltender. Oh, and another big stop. Quick reflexes. You make one, you make two stops before the puck is cleared away. Well, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. He's going off for tripping, Ray. Reaching in for the puck, and he gets a stick caught in their feet. Power play unit going back to work. Oh, here's another power play, James. They haven't been very good so far tonight. Nothing to show for their previous attempts. So now you have to get back to it, adjust, and re-attack on this man advantage. Pokes it away in his own end. Here's a short pass to Gartner. Right in the slot. There's the go-ahead goal, and we have a new game. Taking the lead now, you control it. You push the pace, you push the other guys back on their heels. The Whalers are readying themselves for the face-off here now with a one-goal lead. This late in the second period, they should consider themselves fortunate and just want to get into the intermission with this cushion. Moves it quickly over to Malkin. Here's an odd man rush. That goes off the mask. Well, whatever you got to do, I guess, man, those guys are lucky the masks are as good as they are now. Offense is on face off, and he wins the draw. Denies him on the slapper. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Just moments away from the start of the third period. Here we go. Put up or shut up for both teams here in this third period. We are underway. Well, we've got two periods under our belts to this point so far, Ray. How do you see things? Minnesota's been chasing this game and chasing the puck much of the first two periods. If they're going to get back in it, they've got to possess the puck a lot more. Slides the puck across to Barry. Comes up with the stop. 
Malkin's got it along the boards. Moves the puck along the half wall. Kane swooping in on the attack. And he comes up with a big time save on that. Picked off. Again, the denial by the goaltender. Oh, he's locked right in. A couple of stops in a row there. We're still in the early stages of this period. It's a 2-1 hockey game. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Sends the pass down low. Minnesota's got a hold of it against the wall. Oh, man, James. That was big. Here's a chance right in front. Picks off the pass in the defensive zone. Handles the pass from his goalie. Picks it up. Scores! And now their bench has a little bit of the lead because they evened up the score. The Wild have finally caught up here, evening things up in the third. It's a pretty great effort. They hadn't got frustrated. They kept pushing away. And now they've leveled this game off. No six got it along the wing. That's blocked. Whiffs on that. And another stop. Had to be sharp. That's a great A chance. Oh, aggressive move as he pokes it away. Carlson's moving the puck through his own zone. And now he tries to get it across to Marchand. Take it along the wall. He scores! What a goal! A couple goals in right around a minute and 50 seconds. Conversely, deflating for the other team. And that's kicking the shins right there. They just couldn't stop the bleeding. Minnesota's breathing a bit easier now here, coming up with a big goal in this third period. Their bench was pretty excited when that goal went into the net. Now they'll want to continue to be aggressive and don't let the opponent start to dictate the pace. Quick pass over to Tarasenko. Six minutes, 57 seconds. Into the corner. The Whalers have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Grabs the puck here in the neutral zone. Off oh, target! Minnesota's got a hold of it along the wall. Marner stick handling in his own zone. Quick pass to Marner. Reads the pass perfectly and picks it off. Ahead of steam now towards the front. And there's the save. Past the midway mark of the frame. Minnesota's got the momentum with a one-goal lead. They'd love to add to that. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Big stop by the keeper. Really good stop. After he made the first one, he's got to find the puck, and he's in position again. Sends it over. Stopped by the goaltender. Scooped up along the wall by Dreisaitl. That's a great heads-up play to break up the pass. Turnover short in the ice. You don't need to take chances if you have the lead. Pass to Barkov. Moves it to Kane. Here they come. Three of them. He scores. That's three rings. Yeah, just grab and take the foot off the last pedal at all. Once they got that first one, they kept pushing away. Now they've got three. The Whalers have had more chances offensively, but they have not been able to convert trailing here in this third. Looking to make something happen along the boards. And that shot dies in traffic. Tried to make a move and the puck hops away. 13 minutes, 3 seconds. Quick feed to Barry. And that one's broken up. Puck grabbed by Kane. The Whalers scoop it up along the boards. Verana's taking it from his own end. Moves it around along the half wall. Fires it on net. Off the crossbar. My goodness, what a shot. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Sends it over to Crosby. Can't keep a hold of it. The Wild have taken control of the puck. Carries it in. Right up front, and that's picked off in front. Now he takes it over the line. Minnesota's got the puck along the wall. Good heads-up play in the defensive zone. Here's a short pass to Marchand. Makes the save. And now he angles it across to Ovechkin. Less than a minute to go now here in regulation. Sends it ahead to Tarasenko. 
Great defensive play to come up with the puck. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Looks to get the puck over to Granlin. Lafleur is going to play it from the back of the cage. Scores! He shows no signs of slowing down. Alex Ovechkin. The Whalers have got a big one here in the third now. Well, you got to be careful that the clock melts away fast on you, but now they've got a chance. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Great hand-eye coordination as he gets the puck back. Nice pass. Unloads from the blue line. Oh, that goes high. That almost took some teeth out. Yeah, everybody's dodging for cover on that no one. No kidding. Moves it quickly over to Eichel. And now it's over to Gartner. And we got a delayed penalty coming up here. There goes the whistle. No extra attacker able to get there in time. Pretty cut and dry trip on that play. Coaches will tell you, be careful with your stick, but you're trying to get the puck. I don't think a lot of times they do it intentionally. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Feeds it to Verona. That's taken away. Great defensive effort there. And this one is all over as the final word sounds. Well, the look at it is handy. Control the play at certain points. We had a better face-off percentage, but just not enough.